What's up, DrumMagazine.com? Drum Magazine enthusiast Rich Redman here with the Jason Aldean Band. Welcome to Rich's Corner, beautiful Nashville, Tennessee. This is the final part of our nine-part series on money beats. Money beats, boom, schmack. Boom on one and three, schmack on two and four. This is the groove that makes the whole world go around. So, what we're doing in the last eight lessons, we've talked about using different accent patterns on the hi-hat, adding subdivisions on the snare drum, making sure that our taps are low to the head and our strokes are a full rim shot. We talked about incorporating the ride cymbal, playing linear grooves, and incorporating the left foot on the hi-hat. So for this exercise, we're gonna go ahead and put it all together. Okay, for the first exercise, I'm gonna play with my click track, 95 beats per minute for the rest of you guys that wanna play along. If you could sing it, you could play it. Bukut scat, le bukut de cat, cat you get scat, gun you get cat, a one e and two, a three e and a four e and a one e and two, a three e and a four e and a one, two, three. For exercise number two, a similar thing, except we're going to put the open hi hat stuff on the second part of the phrase. So we get do get got level good scots. Do get got get to good scots. One e and a two e and a three e and four and one e and a two e and a three e and four and you should be able to count and sing the exercise. Okay, here we go. One, two, three. Okay, continuing that open hi-hat idea, the next rhythm, rhythm number three is one E and two and a three E and four, oh, one E and two and a three E and four with the disco hi-hat, which is on the end of the beat, there's an open hi-hat. One and two and three and four. And you combine that with this. One, two, three, Fun, 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 fun. Exercise number four, linear concepts with the open hi-hat and you get scat, got to get scat, scat, got to get scat. A one E and a two E and a two E and four. A one E and a two E and a three E and a four. A one, two, Even, we have, even though we have all this window dressing, the most important thing is the relationship of the kick and snare. So always be thinking in terms of... Okay, now we have some two bar patterns. Two bar phrases. I'm always encouraging my students to think in terms of phrases. Two bar phrases, four bar phrases, eight bar phrases, 16 bar phrases. And this rhythm is one, eight, two, a three, four, a one, two, a three, four, a one. And then we're incorporating drags on the uh of the beats on the snare drum and the disco hi-hat pattern on the hi-hat with the rhythm. And then on the snare drum, You get one, two, three. That's to me, that's what makes it happen. Love that. Okay, similar rhythm on the snare drum, except now we're going to put on the hi hat, the open hi hat is going to be on the downbeat. So we get Got you got you got you got 
if you can sing it, you could play it. So same thing with these concepts. Now try putting these last two patterns on the bell. Instead of opening the hi-hat on the downbeat, we'll play the bell on the downbeat. You get one, two, three. So remember guys, we're only limited by our creativity. Experiment with sound sources, practice these at all tempos and all dynamic levels, play with an electronic sound source like a click track, a metronome, like a Tama rhythm watch, I love those. Um, and be passionate, play these from the heart, count. Play them as many gigs as you can. Um, and just boom smack your way all the way to the bank. Thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.